The Scottish television presenter took a risk in a recent episode of Antiques Road Trip by purchasing a 1930s saucer, without its matching teacup, which was damaged. Natasha persuaded an antiques shop owner to sell her the cracked saucer for half the price it was on sale for. However, she was left gobsmacked when the vintage item sold for a considerable profit at auction on the BBC One program. Natasha and James Braxton were on the penultimate leg of their journey during the episode and after the worrying results from their last auction, they were just scraping by. James pinned his hopes on a bamboo ornament and a very rude-looking dog statue, while Natasha had to turn on the charm to buy a chipped saucer. Away from the shopping, Natasha headed to the Valley of the Racehorse to discover how a Berkshire village was a large part of the sport for more than 300 years. When she continued her hunt for antique items, she had to combat her fear of haggling, but luckily it paid off. I really suffered the Gilded Age star Louisa Jacobson on Marion Roll during the search for treasures to sell at auction, Natasha found a small hand-painted saucer which she soon realized had a hairline crack on. She said, the crack is absolutely tiny, but importantly, it's not interfering with the decoration of this rural hillside site of some rans grazing on the mountain's edge. It's very evocative and absolutely what you want it to be for Worcester. The saucer, which was made in the 1930s and signed by artist T. Baxter, was on sale for £20. I'm going to haggle for it, that's what I came here to do, Natasha said with determination. Trying her luck with the owner of the antiques shop, Natasha asked if she could buy the saucer for just £10. To Natasha's surprise, the owner accepted her offer and hoped she would make a profit at auction. Natasha could not contain her excitement when the opening offer for the cracked saucer was £60. Antiques Road Trips Natasha Raskin Sharp Brands Coast Hara Beast, Latest Where Does Bargain Hunt Presenter Natasha Raskin Sharp Live Now? Explainer Bargain Hunts Natasha Raskin Sharp Addresses Terrible Idea, Insight, She Was Left Open Mouthed When The Item Sold For £110, Which Gave Her A Considerable Profit Of £100. A thrilled Natasha told James who was sitting next to her for the auction, I cannot believe that. Following the auction, it was revealed Natasha started out with £95 to spend but she ended the day on a much healthier £254. 62. James, on the other hand, began with £160, and he finished with an impressive £350. 10. This meant Natasha's overall profit was £159. 60 and James was £190 and 10 pence. After their selling success, Natasha told James, We have made so much money, I am so proud of us, you know. When James asked the Scottish presenter what they should spend their winnings on, Natasha quipped, More antiques. Antiques Road Trip episodes can now be watched on BBC iPlayer.